it's like almost two o'clock in the morning. We just, as you can see, Lisa is clearly upset. I took some pictures of this gigantic bug that crawled up on her foot while we were walking back from the beach party. It was humongous. It was like a dog. And <laughs> look at Lisa's face. Lisa, are you okay, baby? Did the bug almost kill you? You okay? Lee. Lisa. Babe, you okay? Babe. You didn't get bit. Here's the concerning thing. We had four or five people come by and I flagged them down and I said, Insecto on my wife, <laughs> please come here. And I had I had the flashlight on and was showing them the insect and they're like, I've never seen this in my life. <laughs> and they've lived in the Dominican their entire life. So this big ass bug just crawled on her and she says it didn't bite her, but she's freaked out. You okay, hon? No? Do you need to go to the clinic? We do? Seriously? So we might be going to the clinic because she's freaked out. It, it was it was truly scary. I was like, what the? Because after she kicked it off of her foot, it was like, it was like hissing almost. Crazy. Lisa, you okay? What did you describe it as? A prehistoric dinosaur? I'm not laughing at you, I'm laughing with you. You will be laughing at one point over this. Imagine if that bug crawled in here on her face. <laughs> it's not gonna come in the house. It's not gonna come in the room. It's a big ass bug. You okay? Show me your toe. I want to. Give me your toe. Lisa, there's no bite marks. Your toe isn't swollen, nothing. All it did was crawl up on your foot. I never stay up, it's dark. You never gonna stay out till dark? No. As soon as it's dark, where can we go? You can be okay. Calm down. No? Do you have anything to say? Since you almost lost your life to a prehistoric dinosaur. I would have killed him. I would have killed his whole family. <sighs> Did you want to roast it? Yeah, I would roast and kill it and give it a long, long death. <laughs> <laughs> so guys, I stepped on this giant bug to make sure that it didn't run away so I could take pictures. So I, I killed it. I hope it's not an endangered Insect. I'm pretty I don't sure. care if it is. It deserves to die. I'm pretty sure insects aren't endangered, but the thing was impressively large. I said the five people that drove by got out and they were like, No se, no se, we don't know. We never seen that before. It was crazy. <laughs> Sons of the bitches. They Why know. you say that? Because they know. Flicked off the one dude a long time. Asshole. You flipped him off? Yeah, after he spoke English, then he starts to talk to me in Spanish. Idiot. I knew what I was saying, douchebag. So I flipped him off. And that's when he told his stupid friend, let's go. Yeah, so I'm idiot. Whoa. Kill you. The insect or the guy? The guy. <laughs> He's an asshole. He deserves to die. Oh my god. Guys, you see what I have to live with? Unforgiving. You okay? No. I think she's okay, but we're going to bed now. Crazy eventful night. I was not expecting that to happen, were you? I never wish a dinosaur to call up on anybody's foot. <laughs>
<laughs> you never wish that on anyone? No? <laughs> you want the smile so bad. <laughs> you wish a dinosaur never crawled on anyone's butt. <laughs> No, it was evil of the dinosaur to do to me. It wasn't a dinosaur. I think he was a dinosaur. He was so big. I've never seen a bigger dinosaur in my life. <laughs> if that was a dinosaur, I'd kill the last living dinosaur in the world. You should love me because I killed the last dinosaur. He deserves it and he deserves to be roasted. Roasted. Oh, yeah, that's... <laughs> that's another thing. She wasn't happy with the fact that I stomped it to death. She wants to start a fire and slowly roast it to death, even though it's already dead. He deserves a long, slow death. <laughs> even though he's dead, he deserves a long, slow roast. Stupid dinosaur. This is a dinosaur. He's trying to get me. <laughs> that guy's like, was it a bee? Did it sting you? <laughs> no, it's not a bee. It looks like a cockroach. That was crazy, guys. And then she started crying so hard. Guy's like, oh no, you're okay, you're okay. You have many years to live. <laughs> Until I roast his ass, then he'll be laughing. Good night, guys. I'm gonna go on the day three tomorrow. Lisa will be alive tomorrow. I hope she is. Peace out.